The heat is produced geothermally, it's volcanic heat. Um, you can see the steam rising. In some cases around here, the steam's being emitted from very specific small vents. In the ground behind me, it's being emitted over a much wider area. So if you look across this strip, the bare or partly bare strip in the middle is all steaming, is all heated ground. Uh, the surface temperature of this ground is between 30 and 40 degrees C. These little tufts of moss you see growing on it are growing at 30 plus degrees centigrade. And if inserting a probe through them, by the time you get five centimetres below them into the ash, the temperature is up between 60 and 75 degrees centigrade. This is a line effectively of a vent. Um, as we move out to the side, you move away from the vent and the ground cools down. But still, this liverwort, which is predominant in this area, is at a temperature of between 20 and 35 degrees C, and the ground underneath it is still between 30 and 50 degrees C. What's particularly interesting is that different plant species can tolerate different temperature conditions. So in the middle we have a strip of a, a moss, which is probably a Campylopus species, which can tolerate the very high temperatures near the vent. As we move away, a liverwort species comes in, probably a Cryptochyla. Um, as we move yet further away, other moss species come in to cover the cooler ground.